What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about the status uh, for online ordering parts. Basically when you transfer a, a part from next part or our zone, um, we, we need to know if we order that part or we have not ordered that part. That's something that uh, some of you are struggling. Uh, finally came up with a solution that will help you do so. So assume we have a basic old change in alignment and we're just gonna order a starter from next part. And I'm gonna type in starter. Click on next, transfer. Keep in mind, like sometimes, you know, some of the, like that sometimes if I wanna get the labor and the labor don't have it, I still can go somewhere else and grab the labor. Um, I can go to next part someone else and grab the labor. So uh, if you don't want to subscribe to next part, um, you, you still have like uh, options. So I can grab the labor from here. The labor is right here. I'll move myself for a second. Click on add. Close it. Transfer. So keep in mind that you can transfer, you can get the labor from next part from anywhere. Sometimes it's convenient where they have them. Uh, both of them at the same time uh, But it doesn't have you still can grab the labor regardless So if we look at next to the star right now You're gonna see a status and the status saying this is a pending and you can see uh, Distinguish between this line right here that this part it has not been ordered yet and uh, This part if you have a like manual entry part uh, if I said let's say break pads Slash front and assume like, you know, I got it from AutoZone and I got it manually, so there is no status next to it. The only times you're gonna see a status if that part was transferred uh, from the AutoZone, basically from on the online ordering. So if you go back and open Mark again, you're gonna see, you know, the, the part has not been ordered yet. Um, when I'm ready to order it, I just click on place order and then I know this one's highlighted. I'm going to click on the vendor that I got it from. And I'm going to click on place order. And then I'm going to click on return to VSM. So what happened, you're going to see the status has changed to complete it, which means that that, or that that part has been ordered. So you don't have to worry about it. So if I go back and you can see that, um, let's say, Let's get another part and we can show you the differences. So let's say uh, I'm getting a muffler for this car and just get transfer. So notice right here there's a status next to it that this part has not been ordered but this part has been ordered. So basically that's how you keep track of the parts. I think that's going to come really in handy. Um, when you um, to know whether this part was ordered from inside VIP or whether this part was ordered from uh, by phone or something else. Uh, that's it for today. I appreciate you guys watching. Until next time. Thanks for watching.